Hello and welcome back to my Slime Ranger Let's Play series Where we are picking up from where we left off in the last episode Um, I think I know what I want to do today <laughs> First of all, I believe Yes, a coop I want a chicken coop Because I want this area over here to be for slimes And not for chickens So let's just fix that first Put a roost row in here and there we go perfect so they can't get out we have guys over here so i guess we should collect everything and well do stuff um yeah we need some more of these guys so either ow either we need a hmm yeah either we need rocky slimes or we need the type slimes to make some new ones that you guys are probably hungry you berries are your favorite food isn't it there we go. Achievement unlocked. Nice, nice, nice. Let's get this money here. Oh, some more. Perfect. Thank you guys. Whoopsie. <laughs> that was not on purpose. All right. So, let's just sell these and I'll get to what we're going to do in a moment here. Um, hmm, their price is actually going down. Do we have a spot for them in our new silo that we got? Um, no, we actually don't. All right, that's fine. We'll just sell them anyway. Turns he isn't that bad anyhow. So let's just sell these. There we go, all right. So now that it's getting dark, um, I guess we can try and find some more phosphor slimes and also look for some tabby slimes as well. Look at all these guys here. This is gonna be a problem if these guys eat food, um, this guy drops a tabby slime, and that guy drops a, for example, rocket plot, and one of those guys eats that and becomes like a zombie thingy. So I think I want to have. Ow. Ow. I think I want to get a water tank. What? Let's get some of you guys here. And let's get you. Perfect. Let's get you and you. Perfect. Nice. And you. That should do just fine. And I think I have... I don't know how much we will be able to do today. But if we take a look at the map here. Over here. I know over here where we find the tabby slime sometimes. Yep. There we go. Spawning in as I go. Um, there's an area over here. That leads on. And it's kind of dangerous over there. But I do want to go and check it out. At least find the thing to um, show the um, to show that area over there. Now, I do not want to stay for long, but there's a note here which I do want to see and read here. I had a great big tree like this here, one along the edge of my property back on the earth. I had been there before anyone could remember. It survived all kinds of change around it, and then one day I began to notice it was dying. Wasn't anything unnatural, was just its time, I suppose. And then I realized that if I didn't do something, I'd end up like that tree. I'd spend my whole life in the same place. I wasn't going to let that happen, so I bought a ticket for the far, far range the very next day. Hmm, interesting. Oh boy. Nope. Get out, buddy. Alright, well then. Um, I think I got what I need. Let's head back to the ranch. Let's put these two guys in here and I want to do something which is over here I both want to explore that area but I also want to um ow, to get to you see that guy over there we got a very big guy here this fella that we can feed and if we give him um, enough food he will eventually explode and give us I believe he will give us a special key that we can use to unlock a door that is at that area to unlock a new um, a new area with new slimes so we might do that oh chicken oh you're starving you're starving I want to eat that instead then <laughs> I want this chicken there are way too many slimes here I think if there were to come a zombie, 
slime here. I think I would just let it be. I know it sounds a bit maybe evil. I don't know. But um, well, these these guys really there are too many of them. Yeah, I, I knew. I knew that was gonna happen. I knew that was gonna happen here. You know. There we go. Stop making so many plots. <laughs> okay. We're back at the ranch. And let us put these guys in here. There we go. And we can put the rock slimes in here. And I do believe I have a couple of uh, temple plots in here, yes. There we go, perfect. Just gonna feed that to these guys here. Like that. You eat that fella. Ow. I'm taking quite a bit of damage here. There we go. And there's one guy left, right? Yes, you. Perfect. Alright. Let's vacuum all that up. Perfect. Let's make sure that they have chickens. I don't know if they need the separate food. I don't think so. Let's just make sure that they have their favorite food in there to keep them going. And the tabby slimes as well. Oh, sorry, the fossil slimes. So leave that in there. And get all these cube berries and throw some into the fossil slimes pen as well. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, wait, head count. Six. Seven, eight, nine. So nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There we go. Alright, but we're gonna need a lot more food than this. What we got here is not gonna be enough whatsoever. So I might have to take. Um, I might have to go multiple times here. Because I don't have that much food on me. Um, yeah. It's just, I could sleep to get it to daytime, but eh, don't really need to. Do we have any spare carrots? No. I think I might just have to, wait, going the wrong way. Am I going, no, I'm not going the wrong way. <laughs> I think I might have to go, oh, that chicken is being chased. Um, I might have to, what was that? You saw that, right? Hmm. Interesting. Well, I might have to go multiple times here because I don't have that much food on me. At least not enough to feed this guy. He's going to explode at some point. But as you can see, I think he's literally run away or something. Let me just see if I can find some food around here somewhere. Found some. Alright. Yep, there we go. Let's grab all these guys. Got some stuff here. No, do not eat my stuff. Ooh, that's the key. Perfect. Let me just get all this stuff. I don't really want those things there. I don't... Okay. I don't use them for anything. Um, you know what? You guys can be free. And you can have all this food as well. Leftovers. Alright, so we got the key. It says it right down there. Um, about my money. So it's a good thing it doesn't take inventory space like this. Well, goodbye. <laughs> um, oh boy. Let's get rid of you fellas. Real quick. Boom. Man, I really need a water order thing. Let's see if we can buy that actually. Because this is getting out of hand. Like really out of hand. Too many slimes here at the same spot. Yay, we have small chickens. Okay, one small chicken. But it still counts. It still counts. Let's see how much for a water tank. 350. Not quite there, but 
we will be able to get it. Just sell all of these. Perfect. 20 rock plots. I don't know, are there price rising? No, they're still quite low. But, um, it should be fine. There we go. <laughs> that was a lot of money, actually. Let's get... Let's get the water tank. Um, a blast of fresh water will calm down any slime for a short while or dissolve these, those horrible tar slimes. A watered garden crops also grow faster. So that's cool. So I just need to find a water source first in order to suck up the water. So let me just do that real quick. And I think I got the next thing we're gonna do. There is a water spring over here. So I think I just do this. And yeah, I can pretty much use it as a gun. Now, while we are here, this leads into the cave and into another area. I don't know if that area is closed off. Let's have a look. Oh boy. Um... I don't have any food to calm these guys down. That water didn't really help anything. You know what? Just get back. Nope, that's not really what I wanted to do. Um, I wanted to do something else because I saw how much money we got from all that. And I would like to open up one of the areas next to our ranch. There are three areas. Um, a cave, another section. I don't remember what it's called. And then the science lab. The science lab is quite expensive. It costs 10,000, was it new bucks? I believe it was new bucks they were called this money. Um, so we would need quite a bit of money to get that going. Can we get pro collector? No. All right, so, but the other one is just like 2,000. And I think the one that I want to unlock is this one. The overgrowth, the ranch, very own wild side, which could be very interesting, but as you can see the price down there, it's kind of expensive. So, I think, what's this over here? The cave. A dark and gloomy cavern above the sea and a likely first chapter to the no novel of yours. Eh, I would rather have the other one first, actually, I think. Wait, how did... How did he get out? I don't think they got out, but still. Okay, so I think... I think what I want to do is sell all of these, all of this stuff. Even though the price might not, might not be quite as good as it could be. Because I want a plot collector over here and... Eventually an auto feeder, but also I want that area unlocked. So if we just sell all this stuff. And we should, as you can see, be able to pretty quickly get access to one of the new areas. Um, and if we take these as well. Whoops. Sorry, buddy. Let's get all of these. And two more. There we go. Hopefully, if it's not enough, I'll just buy the some other stuff so we can get going with that. Because I don't think, honestly, this would be quite enough. No. So what I'm gonna do instead, I might do some stuff off camera, but let's get a plot collector on this guy. Purchase. Do that. So that's pretty cool. We could do with an auto feeder. But wait a second, where's the... Oh, there he is. Wait, what? Elder Roos through. Hmm. Looks like we might need a, a new guy. Um, okay, so what's next? I know we have a mail. Let's take a look at the mail here. From Ogden Ortix? The name's Ogden Ortix. I'm a slime rancher much like yourself, but I mostly fatty myself as a farmer. I come to the far, far range to grow fruits and veggies the way we used to back on Earth by getting down into the soil and getting your hands dirty. Did you know that carrots have pr improve your night vision? Yeah, seriously, they do. I don't see why all ranchers aren't just gobbling them down every chance they get. Being lost out on the ranch at now can also can be so dangerous. Well, don't let, 
don't let me ramble on you here. We'll be in touch via the drained exchange. I tend to only raise slimes that eat fruits and veggies, so expect those kind of requests from me. Looking forward to doing business with you. P.S. Ever heard of gold ginger? It's a mythical veggie that is said to be the favorite food of the equally mythical gold slime. But some say that neither of them actually exist. Well, maybe we'll see one at some point. You know what? Let's take one of these missions here and see what we can uh, what we can do, and hopefully it'll be something that is actually doable. Let's go. Oh, this is the guy. Okay, he looks happy. I'm working on a new recipe. Help me out. Sure thing. So you need. Oh, that's easy. That's an easy thing. Okay, so four of these. Right, yes, four of those and six heartbeats. Not bad, I like this guy. <laughs> and was it six? I think it was six heartbeats. Six heartbeats. You know what? We can plant the crop as well to make it grow faster. I don't know how we can get it. You know what? We'll get a watering system going at some point. We might actually buy that now. But do that. Yay! Let's get all of our chickens here. And we might as well just put them in here for now. There we go. And a lot of pink plot as well. And I'll just be some there for now. Because why not? Um, so that is the job for today. Hmm. Well then. <laughs> What's next? Um, yeah, what is next? You know what? This I know this video is getting kind of long, like 16 minutes or so. But let us just get over to the area that I was talking about. Um, that was a bit dangerous. And let's just go there and see if we can at least get that section of the map unlocked. All I need to do is just... Ooh, wait. I want the rooster <laughs> because mine is getting old. Let me just regather my water here and let's get over there and see if we can at least um, open this, this area of the map. As you can see, the map is quite big, so let's see if we can do that. Alright, we are here. You know what? I'm gonna take some of these sections. Not you, not Hen Hen. But the stony hen, and maybe we'll get something out of it. Okay, so I know that over here is another one of is another one of these big slimes here, and one of these treasure parts. Um, well, and here is where it gets a bit dangerous. Um, dangerous? Maybe not. <laughs> okay then. Um, never mind. So, so far I only see a bridge here. Um, the bridge is going in that direction and we need one of these keys that we have to open a door like that. Which we will use it for. I don't know what will happen if I fall in the water. I believe I'll just respawn back at home. Um, with nothing. I will lose the stuff that I have on me. Ooh. Definitely want that guy. I don't really care about the hen. I'll use it if we come across any of those nasty slimes. Um, well, I guess let's unlock this place and... You know what? Let's do that in the next episode. Next episode, we'll unlock that place and see what we can get from it. But for right now, I think I'm going to call it an episode. Um, I had actually expected bad guys here. Because I did venture over here at some point. I don't think I showed it in the video because I think the video was kind of long so I cut that part out but um well they're no longer there so that's good. <laughs> I don't remember if I tamed all of them but it's kind of like those with the red eyes in that cave over there but um yeah so far so good we're doing pretty good on money we're doing pretty good on slime so we could do with a new set of slimes so that is going to be interesting if we can get that rolling in the next episode from that place. I'm assuming so. Since new area equals new... Um, new area equals new possibilities, right? So yeah, let's just quickly get this stuff done or out of the inventory. 
and let's call it a day. Well, it seems like we already got a new pen in here or roost room. So oh, we got some, we got some more mail. Uh, let's just give that. Oh, that guy was starving. Okay, well, let's get some food for these guys just before we leave this place. Um, I don't got that many heartbeats, to be honest. Let's see. Um, Newton soil contains compost from the moss blanket and minerals from the indigo quarry. Makes crops always yield the maximum harvest. A spring grain ensures that your crops are always watered, making them grow twice as fast. Let's get that one. Um... The time to keep wandering slimes away from your crafts. We don't really need that. But that is pretty cool right there. And let's get that in there. And let's get some food for the other guys. Just like that. Oh, we got a new mission. But we won't be taking that now. There we go. That'll work. I wonder if we can just... I think we can just mix that in there. Let's just get all of them in there. But I think that'll do it for this episode. We'll check that mail out next time. And um, yeah, we'll take a look at what we can do in that new area. I think we'll use that key to get there. But for right now, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment and share it with your friends. And if you're new to the channel, of course, remember to subscribe. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed and hope to see you. Next time. Ooh, that's a lot of fossil slimes. All right, I'm going to go now. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed. Hope to see you next time. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.